morning guys and girls uh, 8 41 school run again this morning wifey's got a cold so I took both of them in today to snap on Tuesday get excited Yay! tool stuff happening today it's due to be really warm today so shorts are on legs are out Um, we've got a GLA in today, Mercedes GLA. That's having a kind of aerial diagnosis, prognosis. We need to figure out why it's got no reception for anything. Either a booster or aerial pack or cables uh, kind of cut. Um, there's very little information on it, um, other than I think somewhere around the C pillars and up in the top of the tailgate will be where the signal receivers will be and the boosters because the aerial is in the rear glass like in the heater the rear heater sort of um, vented area so a fun day today we've got a kind of probe a Mercedes figure out what's what um, I'm gonna get a chance this afternoon to get on with more of the router work get that Alderson sign underway um, Lee is coming down shortly we're going to be doing the t6 different equipment um so far so good uh, as far as i know everything with the kicker stuff um kicker amplifier has kind of worked but obviously it's a bit basic because we've got no processing um it's just straight speaker to rca conversion so we're gonna go again with a different system so we're going to change to an sr amplifier from alderson and we're going, we're going to go with a bit um bit Nove um, which will process the sound from the head unit but obviously give us a bit more power with the SR amplifier so that should be a bit of a, a bit of a kick up the arse should be a bit louder a bit nicer but I'll come back to you in a bit I've had breakfast this morning cereal and I had an egg not together now we need coffee. See you in a bit. Check the mic and make sure it sounds right, boys. LAN or GLC. Um, we've done a test on the systems, we've cleared down a load of codes, there's loads of missing messages, but there's still no radio reception and it doesn't say that there is no reception, it says radio is unavailable, so it's more like a software thing. Um, but the boosters are actually up in here. Um, these are the aerials here, this one, this one, this one, this one. Um, but the whole section of stuff is here, so you've got like noise control on the sides and filters, and then you've got two boosters like FM, DAB, and then a GPS one out the top of the spoiler. Um, but I phone Mercedes because this seems to be cured by updates, not actually uh, radio reception. So the boosters have power, so unless the boosters are faulty internally, which I won't be able to test for. Um, then that's down to Mercedes, but he's gonna come and pick the car up and get it booked in with Mercedes for a software update for a start. And then obviously if it persists after that, there'll be a, a booster that's needed. Come back to you in a bit. Dealer's trying to lap dance for me. <laughs> These fuckers will get their custom anyway. <laughs> We're just doing Chris's car. So we've got a new set of door speakers in here. Focals, tweeters in there. And we're gonna put a key on this as well once I've sorted out Alfred's wiring. Fantastic, right then. Same flyer, old flyer? Same flyer. Same flyer. Same flyer. Same, Same one as last week. Same Look at the dirt on that. Coming in the treasure trove. You all good then, mate? Yeah, good, you? Oh, yeah. yeah. New wise, um, these are finally in. Ooh, these are what are they? Rounded off. The round off bolts. Torx and Allen keys. Mm -hmm. So obviously, as you see, it's got a round off bolt in there. Ah. So it'll fit a normal one. It'll also fit a rounded one. Round That's one. cool. Um, and the same with the Torx. Ah, so it's like, so what we've basically got is that, what that was, was a normal socket 
that somebody put in a big gun. <laughs> tried, <laughs> tried 300 newton meters and snap and went, hey, there's an idea. <laughs> <laughs> we can charge yeah. double for these. Yeah. That's cool. How much are they? Uh, they're actually they're 70 quid on promo. Are they? Yeah, what, the, for both? No, the Torx are 40 and the Allen keys are 70. Cool. Yeah. Well, we need a set. Well, luckily... I've we got need both. some. Luckily, I've got both still. Awesome. I had 10 sets and I've got a few left. Have you seen the magnetic mat? Yes, have you got one? Have you seen it? No shit, look at that. I have got one, yeah, I've got one. Still got one. Yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? That's cool, you can feel the pull. Yeah, yeah. Customers are going to be complaining though, because everyone is just going to be <laughs> lobbing shit at their car. You know, you feel how heavy that is. Size of... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're not that That's cool. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's got some torque to it, isn't it? Yeah. You can feel that. The only problem is you might lose your keys when you walk past it. Oh yeah, RF, <laughs> RF tag. <laughs> I'd like to pay for this. Oh, you can't. Oh yeah, dear. Yeah. Do you want one? How much are they? Uh, 49 on promo. Whether you're using them or not. It's yeah, my air, air suspension. There's Chunky got on board, he has work. <laughs> <laughs> How's his sandwich? <laughs> How much are they? 40? 49, yeah. Oh, job. Gonna make me brassic and don't forget cars. We'll throw your keys at it. Your immobilizer will go bye bye. Are they safe around stuff like that or not? I don't know. NFC. Don't know. It's gotta it's gotta do something to it. I would have thought so, yeah. What is it? Uh neodymium? The magnet? Mm. I haven't even got a clue, Alex. You you've lost me on that one. Okay. I would have thought so, being as small as it is and being as powerful it is. Yeah. It's like Chris's willy. They call him Neo Didium. <laughs> These nuts. <laughs> Got <he. laughs> <laughs> Oh, you got the hoodies in too. There you go. Magnetic force can be helped with the personal property, equipment, including cell phones, computers, diagnostic equipment, and credit cards. There we go. Yeah, I got some stuff in there. Just some stuff that's going cheap. Some cheap yeah. stuff. Yeah. What we got? I don't know. There's loads of stuff in there. If it's larger, actually, it should be okay. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. <laughs> Alright, I need to pop that down a second. Some stuff I find the locker that needs to be extra large overalls. Oh, they're cool. Yeah. XXXL. <laughs> They're not actually XX, they're XL, it just says it's the number on it, it says 4XL, but it's not, it's XL. So. How much are they? Uh, to you, you can have them for 40, they're normally about 80-ish. I don't know if they'll be any good for you or not. Mate, you can always, always have some overalls. Oh, it doubles up as a race suit, yo. Yeah, he <laughs> can get on his uh, little F1 <laughs> thing. <laughs> it's when they go, here sir, you can come karting, put on this overall, and it's like <laughs> dripping, <laughs> dripping from the last fat guy that's been in it. Yeah, thanks. Oh, don't worry, I brought my own. What the... That's small. It's what is it, a jumper? It's a hoodie, yeah. <clears throat> Long sleeve twill. Double XL. They're yeah, 20 quid each, so. These are actually quite nice. They are nice little jumpers, actually, aren't yeah. they? Yeah, they are. Snap on trousers. Medium. Small. Yeah, it's decently small. So that's overalls again. And there's some big body warmers, but 
they are triple XL and four XL. They're four XL. Mm. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Mm. How much are they? They're like thirty quid each. So, yeah. Nice. Mm -mm. Have we got anything else? That's it, isn't it? That's it, I think. Uh, just loads of different lights on the deal. Got the, obviously the ones that go in there. You've got these ones here. Um, you've got a little, another little one there. Oh, guess what? What? You know my pen light? Yeah, yeah. Found it. <laughs> Where was it? You're not going to want to know. <laughs> Is it a car or? Bottom of my cupboard. Was it? At home. At home. I have no idea how it got there. I'm going to blame the kids yeah. because I would never have put yeah. it there. But they wanted them to take it home accidentally. Or yeah, I don't know, oh, mate. God, yeah, take it home quick. I get in the cupboard. Yeah, you never know. Yeah, literally got home and I put my shorts on this morning and I'm like looked in the cupboard and there it is on the floor and I'm like, what the hell? Yeah, so I found. That's so good. I've now got three. Yeah, which is cool. Spares. So nobody robbed it. That's good. It, it just met good. More, well, yeah. it may have it may have been robbed by my little feral kids. Yeah. <laughs> little bastards. What can you do? Not a lot. Feed them more candy and watch it unfold. Yeah. <laughs> How's the lollies? Yes, lovely, lovely. I'm I'm working my way through them, steady. Yeah, me. I've got to go get some more. Uh... Right. I don't think there's anything else I need. Oh, yep. Sort you out with some pennies. Sub. Sub. Evening everyone. Right, so that's what I mean about light box. How cool is that? Obviously, once those are stuck onto the perspex, it gives us our spacing. And then when I've lit up the light box with colors, that's the kind of result we're gonna get. Obviously, I can finish this in whatever color I want, but that's gonna sit on top of our stand and give us an option to light up the Alderson logo quite well. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so that's the end of uh, Snap on Tuesday. We did buy some stuff today. I've got 
obviously my magnetic mat. And this thing really does um, hold everything. Like, I'm not even joking. It's proper, proper strong magnets. Um, yeah, it, it holds the biggest pry bars. It holds the biggest hammers. Um, we got some snap-on overalls, because why not? I got a snap-on hoodie, because I like my snap-on stuff. We got a snap-on hoodie. Um, I've got the Blue Point hex bit extractors and I've got the Torx extractors too. So a cool little um, a cool little purchase. Um, was that it? I think that was it. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna pack up the cars, get everything in for tonight, um, get ready to go home, but I'm dead chuffed at that. Um, that's quite a quite a nice little result. Bit of hard work, bit of thinking and you end up with something cool. Awesome, right? <laughs> so I will see you bright and early for Wednesday tomorrow. Um, we've got so much in, so much in all week. Uh, my head's pretty much spinning because of it, but um, it's gonna be a busy couple of weeks, I'm sure. Got Chris's car done today. Had the kicker key and the downward firing tens. That was fitted and sounded awesome. He's well chuffed with that. Um, but I'm gonna pack up I'll leave the tidy until tomorrow. I'm just going to lock up and get ready to go home. So thanks for watching, everyone. As always, um, thanks to the new subscribers. We've had some more join, um, which is super, super cool. Thank you. Um, I will catch you tomorrow nice and early for our morning chat. See you then. Bye.